Hi, and welcome back to EG. Today we're going to be starting our pacifist run. Now, the idea of a pacifist run so much isn't for people to not die, it's that you literally don't kill anybody. And I use that with air quotes because people are going to die as a result of your actions. But you're not going to deliver the killing blow, so it's not on your hands. You may also notice that this video is a lot shorter compared to the violent run video. That's because although dialogue changes in pacifist runs, nothing's going to change on level 1 because there hasn't been a chance to be a pacifist yet. It's going to treat all the dialogue exactly the same. We're going to run over to the left here to pick up that one little pickup of uh, experience nano because there's just enough nano on sector 1 to get all the 5 levels for the sector. And that's going to be really important, especially on the pacifist run, because you're going to have to distribute your points differently. You're not going to put any into an attack, because you're not attacking anyone. So it's really important to get every level you can, especially to get more health, because you're going to have to run through enemies, and that deals a lot of damage. Now I'm going to have to apologize for something from the Violent Run video. I said you have to walk all the way back to the left to use that strength up station. I honestly never noticed that one right there, and that's a lot handier. Of course we took those points in strength, because we're still going to get the supercharge. Supercharge is really good, there's honestly no reason to pass up the supercharge. It's a free level, and... As I said before, you really need all the levels you can. Really, I should have taken a level in health right there, but... I don't know, I got this weird stigma about not wasting levels. And really, the reason I say I should have taken that level in strength was there was something I really wanted to show off in this first video, but I just couldn't get it to happen without me dying. Um, one way to get around the pacifist run gimmick is to get enemies to kill themselves. For instance, I kicked that guard there, so he had one life left. I was trying to get him to shoot a rocket and then run straight up to his face so that it would explode in his face and kill him when he hit me, but he was not cooperating, so I said screw it. There'll be time, there'll be chances to show it later. So we're almost hitting the level cap for this sector, and that's really handy because in your pacifist run, because you're not killing anybody for the most part, and picking up nano that way, there will be some levels where you don't hit the level cap. Luckily, you can make it up in later sectors. And when I say you really won't be killing anybody, here's a good example. I'm gonna kick this guy and lower his health to make it go faster, but I'm gonna let the bits take care of him. The bits kill him? And I can collect the nano, no problem. We'll pick up this one, hit the level cap, and we're already done. A solid three and a half minutes. And that's it for the passages run of Sector 1. I'll see you guys over in Sector 2.